Chini umeshtumu vikali matumizi mabaya mamlaka na maafisa usalama wanapokabiliana na waandamanaji. Wakisema hatua hiyo inarudisha taifa nyuma katika hatua zilizopigwa kuzuia visa kama hivyo. Makundi hayo wana harakati yanasema yamenakili visa 27 vya mauaji ya kiholela yanohusisha polisi mwezi huu na anataka aipoa na kitengo cha kuchunguza nidhamu ya maafisa wa polisi kuanzisha uchunguzi dhidi ya makosa yote yaliyotekelezwa na maafisa wa usalama wakati wa maandamano na kuacha kuchukulia hatua za kisheria. Tuungane naye sasa Gatete Njoroge na maelezo zaidi. Ndizo baadhi ya picha ambazo zimekuwa zikinakiliwa wakati wa maandamano ambayo yamekuwa yakiendelea. Maafisa wa usalama wakikabiliana na waandamanaji cha kutamausha hata hivyo ni jinsi baadhi ya polisi wamekuwa wakitumia nguvu kupita kiasi kukabiliana na waandamanaji visa ambavyo makundi ya wanaharakati sasa yanadai vimesababisha kufariki kwa watu na saba mikononi mwa maafisa wa polisi katika chini ya muda wa wiki mbili from July 7th to 19th Civil society organizations have reported 27 extrajudicial summary and arbitrary executions. While President Ruto has promised to end the era of police killer squads, the recent unfolding events reveal that the security agencies have clear intentions to execute protesters. Wanaharakati hao wanadai kuwa visa vyote vya mauaji vilivyoripotiwa eneo la Mlolongo vinaonyesha wazi kulikuwa na njama ya kutumia nguvu kukabiliana na waandamanaji ambao walikuwa kiandamana kutetea haki yao kikatiba wakikashifu utumizi wa magari yasiyo na nambari halali na maafisa wasiovalia sare za kazi The five deaths in Mlolongo are clear examples of state ordered executions Out of these three had gunshots to the head One had gun, a gunshot wound on the chest at close range Pia wameshtumu matamshi ya Rais William Ruto na waziri wa usalama Kithure Kindiki yalionekana kupongeza maafisa wa usalama kwa kutumia nguvu kukabiliana na waandamanaji It is unfortunate and a pity that the president on that thing thanks police who stand in firm and, and ensuring that there is peace katika kaunti ya Kisumu Gavana Anyangnyongo ameshtumu kile anadai ni polisi kuwalenga wakazi wa kaunti hiyo wanaodhulumiwa na baadhi yao kukamatwa na maafisa wa polisi Gavana Nyongo anasema wakazi wa Nyalenda, Manyata, Obunga na Bandani ni miongoni mwa wale ambao wameathirika pakubwa na visa vya polisi kuwadhulumu waandamanaji na wale wasioandamana Gatete njoroge Runinga ya Citizen